Graduates of the University of Kansas School of Engineering Fall Recognition Program cap off the ceremony with a traditional tune. But for one not-so-traditional graduate, this rendition has added meaning. I've heard him sing that many times at basketball events uh, where KU is playing, and he always has gotten up and sang just like he was, you know, an alum. But I've got to think that this maybe really hit home being a true alum now. Kirk's father Warren just turned 90 in December 2013. The same month he was finally awarded his degree in petroleum engineering from KU. Warren Spice. He was an avid basketball player in high school and was a standout in intramurals in the early 1940s at KU, even drawing some short-lived attention from a legendary KU coach. Pog come in and watched me a few minutes, and maybe very few, and said too short and too too slow. <laughs> he was just a few courses shy of earning his degree when he was drafted by the Army for service in World War II. He wound up stationed in Japan for a year, part of the Allied Forces occupation of the island nation to help rebuild after the war. After a year, he returned to southwest Kansas and worked as a farmer and rancher in Hugoton, eventually branching out to oil and gas ventures. You cannot believe how much, uh, how much we put into practice. My engineering practice especially. Machinery on the farm just evolving at that time. And uh, we had a tremendous change and I was prepared to use quite a lot of that. As a surprise for his 90th birthday, his son quietly worked back channels with officials from Rutgers, KU, and the KU School of Engineering to determine Warren had the required credits to earn his degree from KU. Is that you with your diploma? I was just overwhelmed with the uh, happenings here, and I'll, I'll cherish that degree. I have already hung it on the wall above a bunch of pictures of my grandchildren and great-grandchildren.